my name is Renuka. Welcome back to my channel and today is the unboxing of my monthly heroid kit and this time they sent it in a blue tissue paper and with the blue ribbon on it and if you are watching this channel first time let me know that uh, when I am doing unboxing uh, I share lots of ideas maybe I will make those card or not but I share lots of ideas with how you can use this kit and um, when I start processing I will show you the couple of things that how you can use the substitute with this kit if you don't have uh, this kit cause I think this is already sold out so this is a really nice kind of little bit of Persian having a uh, a tint of gray shade ribbon here and you can use those for tags and this kit came with these three things uh, this time the two things um, okay these two water sprays and one is the shimmer one the white one and another is a real nice uh, blue color spray and uh, this is kind of mini mister but bigger than the mini mister and definitely will use those and same time uh, they are quite, quite a nice size and then it also came with this uh, one stencil which having star and moons on it two specialty papers in it some sequins to make the shaker cards so look at this paper oh my god it's so beautiful I think this one is like handmade sheet and then they press and stamp it and this is kind of the volume yeah, I hope light catches that shimmer and then another black background three sheets oh my god really beautiful sheets I don't know where they pick those stuff but yeah and then the star and moon um, the stencil and you can see I'll show you on the black so now you can see that how um, those star and moves and uh, we'll use this also uh, again I don't have the thermo web uh, foiling things but if you have you can do that you can stamp all the um, you can put the thermo web there and then you know, the paste there and then do foiling and um, it's kind of having that nice effect for that thing which is right now in then the stars and shimmers to make a window card ah uh, yeah that's so let's jump into the this big and nice uh, set so i love hero arts kit because they have lots of um stamps and matching dies together with a very less price i must say that's so why i just subscribe to this kit and that's the original thing now here you can see that how that beautiful kind of galaxy but at the same time the sky and those dark background night scene is there most of the people use this uh, paper uh, for their uh, card making i love to keep this paper with my um kind of a kit where I store it and uh, it's kind of inspiration for me you can just inspire with it and create some kind of background so let's jump into the uh, what you have in this so these are the beautiful stamps you have these are the shell outs some of these shell outs and this girl and this like a pathway or the galaxy or it's kind of creating very nice things the stars and the moons let your uh, light shine life is about dreaming you love me more than all the stars these kind of sentences kind of go in everyday card shine bright we all uh, are made stardust and dreaming of you really nice and in the dreaming of you they have a little ship here too yeah i didn't see that that's awesome so yeah i like this shell out where he is like fishing kind of thing instead of moon and you can put some stars or moon here like a balloon with her and then the shell out girl she's like a flying in the sky with those birds and lots of stars different kind of stars different kind of clouds so yeah you have uh, this and with that um, there is matching dies and there is one speciality die which creates the window and that is this die now um, 
if you are a subscriber and you have hero arts previous kits also i'll show you that how you can match uh, that uh, thing now this uh, die is kind of creating window i'll just separate, separate out all these dies so this die is kind of creating window uh, with like little bit of moons and some of the stars and you can use those shakers now now these are the pretty uh, it's kind of saying pretty crude ideas about this um, kit that how uh, you can do now just jump into the real ideas and what i gonna make with this kit and how you can combine your products so let's talk a bit about that if you are a subscriber uh, to hero art kits then um, you already have this uh, die with you it came with that safari kit and I'll show you it's like a big sun or moon whatever you want to create so you can use this die uh, with this kit and there is one more kit came back uh, with the hero arts and I'll show you that also so this in this uh, you can use these clouds those rainbows to match this and especially like this um, this cloud that you can use with this kit and uh, yeah and there are some kind of uh, like um, you can mix and match this sentiment with your sentiment also and some stars and moons also there so these are there now what I'm sharing um, is not uh, yet completed but I will give you kind of sneak a peek that uh, how you can create some of these I already started doing work on this and I'll show you how it's gonna work um, I'm kind of uh, planning to make galaxy series and before that this kit came out and I was like oh my god what's that because everything is like you know more stars uh, Samus is also give their your star um, series and having little bit stars moons and uh, lawn fun also have so um it is a lots of company have this kind of theme but what you can use uh, anything and I'll show you the couple of projects we're gonna make together in upcoming things so these are the starry backgrounds and how I create this I again use the hero arts this stamp um, I don't know it's like I didn't see them at the site maybe it's a retired one or I don't know but it's the starry background stamp you can search for MFT or any other brand and um, then I'll show you the couple of things what you can do with this. So uh, I just add a little bit of distressings here. Then I use the lawn pond die, handmade dies to create this background. We'll create some cards with this. Then how you can use the black and blue background and you can create a moon here. In this I create a galaxy but it's not yet full black. It kind of having those rainbow color. If you watch my rainbow card card series I'll show you how to use the pastel colors to do that then I create some kind of dreamy backgrounds here and I'll show these also that how you can create card with those if you are a hero art subscriber last month we have this beautiful like more weight um, uh, watercolor paper and how you can create the sheer watercolor paper and turn in into galaxy background like this and how you can create your own moon with the watercolors I will also show you the zig color marker techniques again the pastel color these are some masking techniques uh, with the water and distressings I'll show you that and uh, this is the kind of card it's like uh, I'm already um, putting this moon here and how I create this galaxy background and I use the zig clean color markers uh, for this and again this and you don't have to stick galaxy with the black one you can create your own multicolor galaxy and I'll show you that also so I have a couple of ideas in my mind and I already started working on that and before that I want to show you some of the ideas maybe you want to start to work before I did so why not basically I'm here for sharing so you can use the sharing I just create these backgrounds you can put there the stencil here and then uh, you can just you know put a shimmery paste or you can use these nouveau paste you can use the blue one and mix the black one means um, the possibilities are endless you can use the thermo web um, products like the foiling products to you know uh, get them the silvery thing and uh, you can stress you can uh, literally take your pen and pencil and just make some marks and just uh, these are quite a big and bold pattern and you can just stress um, not trace all these uh, sun and moon and um, after that 
you you're gonna just uh, kind of color them like your regular one or color them in a rainbow you can do that another thing you can do with this stencil is uh, you can put a paste here like um, normal um, texture paste and after that you can put little bit of color in texture plate and then just put um a colored one oh okay i'll tell you in a really nice way you can go with any white card like this those are also the upcoming projects then um choose a texture paste uh, took your uh, rainbow colors from the distress inks or any pigment ink and then you can mask these things uh, with the masking paper and just put a rainbow color or any colors you want or you can use the same color with the gradient effect and then just uh, put that paste and after you reveal that you will get a white a stars and moons and the same time uh, you have that ombre effect or rainbow card effect there you can do with that this colorful background also if you want just put in a white paste the texture paste and that's going to give a really nice effect and you have this couple of shimmer a bottle here you can just spray those and all things are ready then you have to just add the sentiment there like you are a star or something like that and um, you don't have to stop yourself by this this is crescent shape you can cut out and create anything on these cards the same times if you have the star shaped dies i have the six one so you can use those also so these are the couple of ideas I have in my mind. I, I want to make more cards than I ever seen. And um, now this these papers are quite a nice one. But um, if you want to use them, you can use this only this paper. And this is quite a bright one to use those. But rather than using the shell outs each time with the black, you can heat emboss them so you will get a white effect. Then you cut out and put them here so that this background gonna pop. Or you can color them basically you can just um, put the color on the paper I'll show you how you can uh, color those shell outs like this paper I put the distressings here smooshing technique and then I go with this girl I stamp it with the versa fine ink and then what I'm going to do is I will plan to um, heat emboss it with the clear um, powder so green just clear powder or any clear powder will do and then uh, you just heat set that and then you can cut out it with the matching dyes they are providing so your girl is kind of colorful there so you don't have to stick here into black and white or the black shell outs or um, it's kind of uh, galaxies always is a black so you have this good but you can get a uh, lots of stuff with it means you can create the christmas cards as well i'm gonna make some christmas card with this kit also and um i hope uh you kind of join me and stay with me that how i will create all those cards and um believe me when i got some products or kits i have lots of my ideas in my mind jumping here and there and uh, sometimes i'm not to have that much time to complete it i have a little one if you know that and i should uh, give him a much time more time so this is like my hobby where i'm sharing this so um while creating this card like uh, one kit and 10 and more cards or galaxy background series um i will talk more about these kids and if you don't have the this kit particular this kit how you can uh, substitute other products to make that kind of card i will give you that uh, hints and ideas also and the same time today i have these idea but when i start making i will make totally different cards so i have more ideas to share with you so what i suggest is subscribe to my channel if you like my ideas and if you want me to see how i use this kit and you can watch the um, previous videos that how i done with uh, hero arts kit and my other videos too and um, i will uh, tell you the lots of things that how you can create the galaxy background um, with the different different products and um, you will amaze that how the small old school techniques gonna get a really nice crisp um, beautiful card backgrounds so thanks for joining me today and giving your time and i always want to thanks all of them who appreciate me watch me leaving comment for me giving me lots of love so um, until the next crafty project when i got to work on this have a crafty life bye bye